video we're going to talk about duplicate entities. Uh, duplicate entity occurs when you copy and paste one object on top of the other. In Bobcad it looks uh, it looks just fine. You can't tell there's a duplicate entity because they're stacked one on top of each other. Uh, that job will not cut correctly in SheetCam. So let's draw a square first. We'll demonstrate using the square. So let's do a, oh, let's say a four by six square, and drop it right there. And cancel. Okay. So now we have we have these uh, four lines creating this rectangle. So what we're going to do is highlight that. Okay, and we're going to just copy and paste. And we can do that here, or we can uh, use control C and control V, which is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to say control C, then I'm going to hit control V a number of times, five or six times. Okay, so we should, we, no, we now have about five or six rectangles stacked on top of each other. Okay, so we're going to escape out of that. I'm going to go back into uh, select mode and just prove to you that we have stacked entities. So I'm going to highlight one of these lines, and this would be the top one. And I'm going to delete, hit delete. Okay, notice how it didn't go away. It actually did go away, but we have now four or five more lines right underneath it. Okay, so if I uh, created the DXF file, it would create just fine. It's going to go into SheetCam. SheetCam's going to see every one of those, and uh, it, it's not going to, the job's not going to, uh, not going to work out right. Uh, so in order to deal with that, uh, there's a function in, uh, in utilities. So we're going to say utilities, and uh, we're going to reorganize, and we're going to erase doubles. Okay, we're going to draw a box around that, and we're going to say OK. That's it. Now the doubles are gone, and if we cancel and we go back into select, we'll notice that when we select one of these and we delete it, it is actually gone. So we have all of our stacked duplicates are now gone. And uh, if, if you ever have a job in SheetCam where you have multiple start points, uh, it, it's not, and, and SheetCam is not producing the offset uh, that you expect it is, just come back, uh, bring your DXF back into Bobcad and reorganize it and uh, erase those doubles. And we'll see you in the next video.